Hi guys, Harshkun here. It's been a while since I made a video. Uh, for a long time like this, talking like this. But uh, things have changed. Uh, we got a new Tekken 8 trailer, a story trailer. And I mean, that got me thinking. Uh, actually, I I'm not kidding. I actually didn't sleep last night at all. I was thinking about of what could happen in the story. And I actually did. Uh, I actually did find some stuff. I, I did connect some dots and I, I, I'm not gonna lie, I, I kind of feel like Batman now. <laughs> you know what I'm gonna do? I'm just gonna have fun and I'm gonna pretend, uh, sorry, not pretend. I'm gonna predict this, uh, what happens in the story according to the trailers. So, I think, uh, yeah, we should get on with it. Let's start. Alright, so here's my first theory. Everyone is saying like this is Jin's subconscious and uh, Jun is in there because he, uh, of course, he loves uh, his mother. But I think it's a bit different than that. It is, yes, it is Jin's subconscious, but it's not like he's remembering or something. I think, uh, I mean, uh, the thing is, uh, this uh, whole trailer was so hyped that we actually forgot about something very s important to the story, which is this. You know? <clears throat> Do you guys remember seeing this? This fucker? <clears throat> so we do know he does take control at some point. Ah, uh, yeah? So Jin is not in control anymore. Look right here, it's very important. It's a special interaction of Jin with uh, Devil Jin. And I think we know now. If you have special interaction in the game, then you, it's very likely that he... Those two characters have interact in the story as well at some point because we've seen uh, what's her name? Uh, even Azucena and uh, Leo has interaction in the trailer. We've seen the Mishima uh, G Corp stuff, coffee and all, coffee and all. So yeah, it's very likely that these two will fight, and that's why we have this special interaction. She says, uh, "Get out of my, don't be consumed by the power gen." Yeah. So, thing is. I think Jun actually comes out. She's not dead yet. It's been clear by the devs that she's not dead. Harada-san has said it so many times. She's not dead. She's alive. She's just missing. So she probably comes out when Devil Jin is wreaking havoc and then fights him and somehow subdues him. Maybe with the help of uh, the other characters that we've seen in trailers doing some stuff at Yakushima. Then uh, she'll see Jin here. Sitting alone. Helpless. Like this. Trapped in a uh, devil jin's mind. And there are the chains. Yes, yeah, so I think she will come and uh, she will peer into the devil jin's mind and then save a jin basically. And then he will get the control back and whatever. Like she gives her the power right here. Use this power to save herself and Kazuya. Also, you know, the biggest uh, theory I have <coughs> is a bit wild. So, this, you see. I think this is not the final fight. I get it's the rain stage and all, but there are there are uh, things that backs my uh, prediction. Let's say. And first off, they have this these clothes. And uh, remember seeing the first trailer? We haven't seen these clothes yet. Here. So, I mean, uh, about this article, uh, when they dropped this in the article, they said it's from the midpoint of the story. <clears throat> so I think this is the fight, but they've changed the costumes. So I think these costumes will be there. And, I mean, we know the, these costumes are in the game. So I think these costumes will go to the final fight and not, and this is, I really think this is not the final fight. And considering what they've been doing, I think, yeah, they have the ability to hide everything. You know, like uh, Avengers or Marvel, uh, they do in the trailers, they don't show at uh, half final things at all. So I think it's like that. I think this is just a mid fight. And I... I yeah, it, it it it's very possible considering how how big they have become now, Bandai Namco. I mean Tekken uh, per se. So I think this might be the mid fight, and then the final fight I think uh, will happen into the 
stratosphere space uh, stratosphere stage the one that's in space i think both of these uh, jane and kazia will have the their full devil form and i think then they will fire it off on the in space and, and that makes sense like we have it could, it could very well be possible because they they can just keep it as a surprise is this i mean they've been doing some things like that like can you look at this we didn't we didn't expect all of this did we all these people together this was a surprise so maybe there are more surprises we are yet to find out so i really think this again it's just me thinking who knows maybe it is the final fight yeah maybe it is the final fight but i still think uh, there's chance that uh, they have some surprise for us in the end and uh, yeah i think the final fight might happen in that stage in the space something really epic and so that's theory number 2 and up next i think it's pretty evident like everyone is saying i think people have all the same thing in the mind that uh, kazia takes us as well and i i think i would agree with that i he does look as is well. he it does look like as is look at that especially the coloring now it's it's light purple something like really like purple and pinkish kazia's uh, kazia's like true devil is like dark uh, blue dark uh, purple but this one is on the pink more on the pink side so i think yeah he might have like as uh, absorbed as is well maybe half or who knows full because if we also see all, all yeah these guys running away and i don't know where and they are running from because if if it was after this this instance oh wait there is claudio here claudio zafina and show you is show you there show you is not there but who knows maybe like It's a, there are chances that maybe he absorbs a zafina from here and then they have to run away from kazuya very possible and yeah i think if if the if my second theory is correct that uh, this is not the final fight this one so i think this is uh, the point where jin jin will lose control oh, sorry we don't have to see kazuya's kk right here yeah might lose to this cause yeah again and then um, devilgen comes out <laughs> takes control and then he takes have a uh, have a of his own in the city and we can clearly see here now, it's clearly not after the gen fight uh, we saw because after that uh, this happens after the first chapter fight we have with cause yeah i think he will wake up after that and then all these uh, guys will get together and then go to the tournament then uh, kazia gets the uh, azazel because again that that also one thing also supports that he does this kazia yeah so it looks like it's right after the coliseum uh, things that happened in coliseum stage And I think he goes up he fights everyone off and then I think he's fighting Jin here Who knows Jin is on the uh, and he throws this laser beam on some kind of island Yep So who knows this might be the island He throws this and then the island gets destroyed and this is what happens after It is very like the, yeah i think it's not like out of the line that makes sense that 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 could very well happen and then they fire it off and then jin loses again i mean and then third times the charm <laughs> but i really think this is not the final fight please if it's not final uh, if it's not the final fight just wait like how many things there still might be i think tekken 8 will have like 11 to 12 chapters i really think but who knows uh, it could just be 10 but yeah th this this looks less like final fight and some build up for the final fight or some build up for devil jin to come out they made it look like he, uh, final fight in this trailer because it's a trailer you know but i really don't think this is a final fight this is not the finale nah 
think there's more up their sleeves that they're hiding. And that's good. Uh, that, that's really good. Yes, we're only. Yeah, so he destroys the island and they fire it off here. And where's that into the stratosphere stage? Yeah, so this stage, uh, they didn't just make it for nothing. Yeah, so this stage, this is a, like, this, this, first of all, this stage is really beautiful. It's like, uh, I haven't seen any other stage like this in Tekken. I think it's the first time we're seeing something like this on this spectacle in Tekken. And it's, yeah, it's, yeah, it's I love this. Like, look at those meteors going around in the background. So, this, this makes perfect stage for the final battle. This stage screams finale to me. Literally, I, I really think this will be the final fight here. I mean, why else would they make this beautiful stage? Like, why? Just to have Paul fight aliens? I don't think that's the case anymore. They're taking Paul serious now. It's good. Uh, yeah, so it could it, it could very well be you know, the final stage for the final fight. I really think that's the case. Yeah, so that's it for my predictions today. Uh, if you uh, let me know if you agree with my predictions or not, and even if you have your own predictions, uh, tell me in the comments down below. I love to read your what you you guys have up your sleeves. And I I get, yeah, let's keep this going. I guess. I mean, Tekken Eight is like uh, a bit more than one month away like one month and 12 days something so uh, it's it's gonna be fun uh it's just gonna be fun man <laughs> i can't wait it's really hard i'll right, see you later